I'm at 6307 Hilltop. Here's the neighborhood. So this neighborhood is um, considered in flood zone as well. And this is Quartz Street here, and then that takes you down to the beach. Some uh, duplexes on this side, and a single family home on the right side, and uh, another single family home on the left side. So this is a three bedroom, two bath. Uh, exterior has a new roof. This uh, carport, um, all windows are good. I checked them out. Exterior walls are also uh, hardy board. So that is perfect for our area. This has 10 foot ceilings. Feels very spacious. Open floor plan with the kitchen right there. Um, it's plenty of cabinets. I think they had a plumbing leak. I already checked it out again. I had a, they had a plumbing leak, so which sort of fixed, but you can see the damage that there was uh, from the leak. Here's the kitchen. And then the AC unit is here. AC has also been replaced. It's a newer or mm, not sure if you'll tell you the date, but that should be newer 2020, I believe. And here's the front bedroom. It, it is smaller. It's probably more meant for more of an office, but it does have a window. It does have a closet. And then also you, you notice it has tile throughout, no carpeting. Here's bedroom number two. Again, tall uh, 10 foot ceilings. And then master bedroom. Well, here's the hallway bathroom and then a master bedroom. The house is moving ready, in my opinion. I mean, it's really nice, painted, um, looks good, feels good, smells good. Here's the hallway bathroom. The drawback on this one is going to be the hump due to the septic tank in the back. I'll show you here in a minute. And then let me show you the laundry room as well. So here's a separate laundry room. The water heater is 2018. This one has AC vent, so it is heated in cooled space as well. And that's the only way to get in and out of the house, looks like. I don't see any other doors. Let me take you out to the backyard and show you the backyard. Okay, so this is what I was telling you about, this hump, and unfortunately um, the only way to remove it obviously is to either um, to hook up to the city sewer line, which is currently not available on the street and it's going to be pretty costly to run it here. So here's this hump, there's probably a way to add a decking out in the back here, um, you know. Um, all the way to the end of the house from here on to here kind of uh, raised and to try to maximize um, this opportunity in this backyard so you can tell right here how tall it is and here's the side yard the AC just kicked in very quiet you can tell it's a new AC Overall, the house is great, big windows, plenty of light, uh, inside and outside in a great condition. The backyard is how it is. I like the tall privacy fence, eight foot on both sides, so that's good as well.